everybody deserves clean water. It's a right to life. Water is life. I now have police department is approaching me. I'm totally allowed to be here, man. People, people assembly is encouraged. I just want to talk to you and get contact information, and that's all. You're allowed to be here and protest as long as you like. Thank we you. We were informed that you'd be here and that there might be a few other people assembling. So, uh, do you mind if I get your name? Not at all. Okay, I'm just going to write it down from my notes. Okay. That's fine. I, I'm going to continue recording until I leave. Absolutely, there's no problem with that. You're allowed to do so. So, what's your name, ma'am? My name is Kim Cooper. Kim Cooper. And what's your date of birth? April the 5th, 1963. April 5th, 1963. And where do you live, Kim? I currently live in Smooth Rock Falls. Okay. Uh, what's the address there? Uh, I'm just going to... Yeah, whatever you got to do. No problem. Number uh, 45 5th Street. 45 5th Street. And do you have a phone number we could get a hold of you if we need yeah, to? Yeah, 705 622 0777. Okay, so like I said, peaceful assembly is encouraged. We're happy that you're here and you're, you're voicing your concerns over the pipeline. I've done a little bit of research and I understand what it's about. Um, we figured there'd be a few people here with you. We just came in to see how things are going. I'm very disappointed that nobody else is here, yeah. but I refuse to stop. Okay, that, and that's fine. You can go ahead as long as you're not bothering the people that walk by. You can you can do what, I, what you're doing right now is perfect. So. I, I researched and I understand yeah. I'm not allowed to disrupt the flow of business, but I am allowed to peacefully protest and voice my concerns. Excellent. You're you're better informed than most people that protest. So I'm, I'm glad you've gone ahead and done that in the, in the meantime. Um, what time do you plan on being around today? Uh, I figured I'd stay here for approximately 30 minutes and hope that somebody else would show up, and at that time I'll probably be carrying on. Okay, no problem. If there's any issues, if uh, anybody gives you a problem, you can let us know as well, okay? Because you're allowed to be here. Thank you very much. Okay, you take care. Thank you. Talk to you soon. Okay, uh, yeah. So, okay, so I'm in tears. I'm shaking like a leaf here. I just got a visit from the cops, and they were very encouraging, and I'm very glad for that. Uh, I've never done anything like this before, so I am shaking like a leaf, and I am crying. I'm scared. But apparently I'm good. <laughs> I've done my research, so we're good. Okay, so back to it. Okay, so take your money out of TD Bank. I had a good conversation with the police officers that just joined me here. They informed me that it is my right to protest. They also informed me that they had done my, their research, and they understand why I'm here. That should speak volumes to you. The police officers that attended this scene understand the situation. That speaks that they are also concerned. We should all be concerned. Ask questions. When you do not get the answers you seek, speak with your dollars and withdraw your money from TD Bank. Do not support Dakota Access Pipeline with your money. Support clean and free water rights. They are currently supporting an illegal pipeline. An order from the Army Corps of Engineers has been issued to cease and desist. They have chosen to go forward and pay the fines because they make more money. Remember that. It's your money that's supplying them with their ammo. Speak with education. Find out. Ask questions. Don't support Dakota Access Pipeline with your earned dollars.